Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Rayman Origins. Been a minute since I last played this, but I think I can manage. Anyway, here we are in the Sea of Serendipity, about to take on the first stage located here. Port Opanic, so let's go ahead and do it. Oh man, I really hope I'm not too rusty. It has been ages since I last played this, and by ages I mean possibly a week and a half at the most. Alright, here we are, back in the land of Rayman. We got enemies... Oh. Okay, well he wasn't an enemy, or rather, an enemy was attacking that glow box. That red glow box, and I cannot get up here. Okay, yes, I'm up here. I knew there was something there. Actually, no, I, I was just taking a chance. But this room seems easy enough. And... Okay. This might be a quick level, huh? Alright, well we saved our first batch of Electoons, so now we're free to explore more of this place. Heart, thank you. Okay, yes, those dark Electoons or Dark Lums, or whatever they are. They're, they're evil, that's all you need to know. But yes, they are attacking these harmless glow boxes. Glow... Glow by? The plural of glow box. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with glow boxes. Why not? That sounds... good enough. Oh yeah, I can't swim yet. Spoiler alert, we're about to begin that ability relatively soon. By relatively soon, I mean in this level. Hmm, can I make... Nah, I can't make that. But I am passing stuff up top, so just gonna make a quick little detour. Okay, gotta avoid the ugh, fire, because fire does in fact hurt. Okay. Totally worth it for those few lums. All right, so we have a new nymph to save. She wants out. Hey, you know the drill. All right, so here we go. We're running and gunning and just, you know, saving the glow boxes that are in our way as we pursue this thing. Oh no, he went to the background. Ah, oh, crap. How am I still alive? And how do they expect you to grab that and do? Okay, let's try that again. Yeah, I was about to say, how did they expect you to grab that skull coin that was up top? I guess you just have to be fast. Yeah, like that. Okay, wow. Oh, nope. I'm dying. Okay, well, actually, no, I'm at the end of this area. Alright. Oh, no, heart. Heart. No, heart. I, I would rather die than leave a heart behind. Kind of defeats the purpose of having a heart, but, eh, whatever. Damn it, it's, it's just not meant to be. It's just not meant to be. Alright, well, maybe like, it, maybe it can still happen. Maybe that's fate trying to tell me something. Yes, I have my heart. I have my insurance policy. And I will not cash in on it just yet. Oh, okay. Um, I'm kind of failing miserably right now. Okay. Let's try this again, only without screwing up. Yeah, let's grab that skull coin while we're at it. Okay, good, good job. We're doing find another skull coin? No, uh, whatever. All right, so we just do that and... All right, so we just do that and there we go. Yeah, that top she's wearing, that doesn't look too family friendly, but whatever. Now we have the power to dive. Or swim. Well, actually, no, nah, Rayman could swim, so I guess it is the power to dive. Yeah. Luckily, Rayman can breathe the uh, forever underwater, so that's always good. And yes, here we go. I love 
the underwater theme for this game so much. It's just so whimsical. And even when I was playing this, I would sometimes catch myself just singing along with them. It's just so cutesy and whimsical and fun. It makes water levels fun in this game. And not not taking anything away from, you know, under uh, other underwater themes, you know, like in Mario games and that that that's pretty much it. I mean I, I can't really think of any other games that have a specific theme for underwater sections. I mean I, I guess Sonic for the water themed zones, but still there's a lot of out of water stuff you're doing in those games too. You cannot kill those things. Good to know. Okay, we're just gonna avoid them. Wait, that was a spike. We do not touch those. But we go down here to save an Electoon. Okay, this looks confusing as all hell. Wait, no, there are fish hidden amongst the fish. There are evil fish hidden amongst the fish. Okay. And one more. Oh wait, no. One more. And these Electoons are saved. They're just so happy to not be enslaved. Well, actually, no, they're not really enslaved. It's more or less, you know, confined to a cage. Either way, it's not a pleasant experience, I would assume. I mean, I've never been caged myself, but yeah, it, it, it just looks uncomfortable, you know, barely able to move around, not knowing if the people that caught you are going to brutally murder you or just, you know, eat you. Well, being eaten is also rather brutal, so you, you know what, whatever, they're, they're just going to do unspeakable things to you, that, that much you know when you're trapped inside of a cage. Or maybe they're just gonna keep you there and stare at you and, and laugh. Laugh at the fact that you are not free. Which that 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 must suck as well. Wait. I can exit the water, but there is still stuff down here. The fact that I managed to do that unscathed is amazing to me. I will not be able to get out of here alive. Crap! Okay. I got out of there alive, but I cashed in on my insurance. And ah, There's still more level. Okay. Alright. I do not want to die just yet. I have so much to accomplish, so many lums and electoons to save. Like these. Yeah, I'm just gonna let this waste. I'd rather be careful right now. At least I got my 300. That's all that matters. I don't care about 350. I wasn't going to get that regardless. Alright, so let's go ahead. And... I can't hit the bombs? Oh, that's right. I gotta use catap... But catapult power! Alright. Catapult power. It's good power. Okay, well let me just go ahead and grab that electum right there. I mean lum right there. So we can save... These electums. Oh boy. I've been recording for 10 minutes. It took me 9 minutes to beat that level. Oh my god, I need to step up the pace. <sighs> ah, the lum meter. I forgot all about this. Man, they just look so happy though. I mean, my god. They're just, just grinning the day away. But, yeah, yeah. I guess it's to be expected. All right. Okay, and so now that we've beaten the port o panic we have unlocked a new character in the snoring tree. But we have also unlocked... Swimming with Stars, and... Unlocking that character reminded me of something. I think I was actually going to uh, 
do a level or two with a new character at the end of the previous part. So let, let, let's just go ahead and grab somebody. Let's grab the newest character we unlocked. Who did we unlock? Why, it's a teensy reskin. But which one is it? Ninja Teensy, oh yeah, yeah, we, we can definitely do some of this. All right, Ninja Teensy. I have been in a ninja mood recently. Well, can't really say ninja mood. I mean, all I did was just read a volume of Naruto, which is getting really good, even though he's dragging on the ninja war or shinobi war rather long. And you all don't care about Naruto. You all care about swimming with stars. <laughs> that would not be a good reality show. I mean, yeah, there's dancing with the stars, but I don't think people want to swim with the stars. But anyway, we are Ninja Teensy. We can float. And do the same things we could do as Rayman. It's nothing special. Okay. So now we got these things. They are annoying. You just want to avoid them. If you hit that little orb thing, eh, I took the hit just to show it off. But yeah, if you hit that, they disappear. That'll be important later on. I guess I could have waited till later on to show that off, but eh, I'm not patient. And now we are descending into hell, where we no longer get the whimsical underwater music, but rather ambient noise and pianos. If you can call that a piano. Yeah, yeah, yeah that sounds like a piano. Alright, so anyway, I hit you just because. Uh, there should be something over in here. There is absolutely nothing over here. Just things that wish to do me harm. <sighs> Don't you just hate it when that happens? Uh, you, you think you're on your way to finding something neat, but no. It's just things that want you dead. <sighs> I hate finding things that want me dead. Yeah, whatever. Like, greed take over. The fact that I did not get hurt there is amazing. Skull coin. Thank you for my 25 lums. The exchange rate is a beautiful thing. One skull coin for 25 lums. Amazing. Alright. Okay, so far so good. Up, oh, jellyfish. I want that coin. Crap. I got greedy. I got greedy. All right. You know what? We're, we're, we're just going to speed through this. I'm not going to be too greedy. I'm, I'm going to be stupid, though. You know, there, there's, there's always time for that. <sighs> okay. You know what? Cut in the head. I'll just be greedy off camera. Okay, yeah, I'm giving up on that skull coin right there. I just can't get it without getting hurt. That was like attempt number five. And, you know what? You know what? No, no, I'm not giving up like that. I'm not giving up like that. Okay. You know what? You know what? I'm, I'm just going about this all wrong. See, I, I'm not being patient. That That's my undoing. Aha! Give me my lums. All right. And now, onward to the next area. All you have to do is just stand still, and you will be fine. So many jellyfish. Okay. I mean, yeah, I know they can be dangerous, but come on, there, there's more, ooh. Yeah, there, there's other kinds of dangerous aquatic life out there. It doesn't have to be just jellyfish. Even though I'm sure a jellyfish sting does hurt very bad, I've never experienced 
a jellyfish thing. I'm just inferring that based on how many episodes of SpongeBob I've seen. And I've seen quite a few episodes of SpongeBob. Okay. Hmm, no trapped electoons yet. Oh god, this place. Alright, so yes, we have these little firefly things to protect us from the monstrosities that lurk in the darkness. For if these fireflies leave you, you are dead. Okay, is there stuff up here? Oh, I think this is the correct path. No. Okay, so what's down here? Okay, there's absolutely nothing down there. So onward to the correct path. Oh my god, this is nerve-wracking. I, I really hope they're not about to... Okay, well, I'm right here. Because, yeah, they go away after a certain amount of time. And that's never good. Okay, seriously, are there any trapped electoons? Yes, here we go, okay. I wonder, because it's... We've been in this level for a minute without encountering any, so... Wow, wow. How did I not die? Okay. I'm gonna hit that, and that thing's about to die. Okay. Go up. Okay, one more, and we're done. Seriously, I'm progressing through this level rather slowly. I need to pick up the pace. All right, so we did that. So now we're free to go down here, explore more of the level, getting rid of these evil hands. Seriously, video games and evil hands, they're... It's, it's ridiculous. Yes, yeah, since we no longer have our firefly buddies, we just need to hang around these lanternfish and the anglerfish. I mean, the, that giant red fish is an anglerfish. I, I have no clue what these are, so that's why I'm calling them lanternfishes. And here we are in safety! Crap. Double the lums for our enjoyment. And I wasted that double period so horribly. Oh, well, whatever. My god, I just love the choir of fish that just sing. It's so, so pleasing to me. Pleasing to the senses. Some people are annoyed by it, and I don't understand why. I swam into him like a dummy. Like a very dumb person would do. Okay. Yeah, this level's not that bad. You just need to, you know, take your time in certain spots and... Just, just not play horribly. Damn it, I'm going for that skull coin. Okay, no. No, I, I think I'll just pass on that skull coin. It, it's not that serious. <laughs> okay. Actually, I think I might be able to. Ooh. See, I'm not too comfortable going for that without a heart. Whatever. Just going to the next area. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go back and go for it. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. You gotta be bold. You gotta be brave. Like Parappa. You just gotta believe. Man, I have not played Parappa the Rapper in ages. Why is there not a Parappa the Rapper 3? Seriously, Sony, why didn't you do a Parappa the Rapper 3 for PS3? Oh, well, let's let's not dwell on that. We're playing Rayman. This has nothing to do with Parappa the Rapper. I do not like this area. It is very nerve-wracking. Okay. 
Lead the way, anglerfish. Lead the way, is there something down here? No, okay, do not leave me, anglerfish. Also cannot touch you, for I will take damage. I'm gonna leave that King Lum right there. Just following anglerfish here, just in case he'll lead me to where hidden electoons are. It does not look like it. Okay, well, that was a total waste of time. <sighs> Wait, I hear trap electoon. I just don't see trap electoon. That was a waste. It was down, yeah, it was down here the whole time. So many fish to kill. We can also, you know, guide that uh, jellyfish thing into the fish to kill them, but yeah, where, where's the fun in that? Killing enemies by being passive. <laughs> Who would waste their time doing that? Okay, so now... Ooh. Okay. You just got to avoid being in the darkness for too long. If if that lantern fish could move over, that would be great. Thank you. Final area. Okay. And done. All right. That took ages. <laughs> And I'm at 297. Well, that's disheartening. Because in that successful run with that first room where I cut ahead, I skipped out of the lungs at the very beginning of that room. Had I got them, I would have had 300. Oh uh, well, I just didn't want to risk getting hurt by the jellyfish there. So now that we're done swimming with the stars, that level name doesn't really make too much sense now, does it? We didn't really see too many stars. Hmm. Anyway, now that we're done with that, onward to freaking Flipper. Sorry for being silent, I'm just trying to figure out like what in the world that's referencing. I guess nothing in particular. Ah, we're back to the happy fish. That's always good. No darkness, nothing evil, just... Just happy fish and swimming. And we got jellyfish, but you know, they're, they're, they're not even trying to hurt us right now. Got more lums. Oh, okay, wait, wait, we, we got evil rock. Fish, I assume. I assume that's a fish. I don't know. All I just know is that it's it's a rock and it's trying to kill us, just like that Marlin did. But I killed it. Wow. O okay. Well, I managed to do that without getting hurt. How am I not getting hurt by these swordfish? Seriously. I'm just oh god nope there's something behind you yes there is yes all right so let's go ahead kill that fish oh no those look like flying fish but huh they're behaving like piranhas unless in the Rayman universe that is how flying fish act and if so that is horrible. I would not want to live in a world where flying fish are actively trying to murder you. That that does not seem pleasant. All right, let's just go down here. No, 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 no. Okay, no, no, stop. How rude of those rock fish. Okay. And onward to the next area. Ooh, a sunken ship. I still have no clue what any of this has to do with Flipper, but eh, whatever. Maybe they just needed a 
somewhat stereotypical, you know, water themed level name. I mean, flippers are on fish, I assume. Well, actually, no, fish have fins. I don't know what I'm trying to say anymore. Okay. Yes. Okay, King Lum. Wow. Okay. Alright, well I managed to get 99% of them, so that that's that's nice. 99% is still an A. Okay, now we're dealing with currents. <sighs> currents are not your friends. Currents are not your friends? Well, current is not your friend. Singular. Haha. -ha. Okay. Alright. This is nerve-wracking. This is so very nerve-wracking. I do not like this. Do not want... Do not want... Okay. We're out of the current. Oh, no rockfish? No! Not today, rockfish. Not today. Seriously, they're just so freaking rude. I mean, they're, they're trying to suck you up without your permission. That's, that's just... That's just messed up. Yeah, there doesn't seem to be anything down there. Okay, good. I didn't miss anything. So, yep, you're down here. Alright. I already screwed that up. But yeah, I, I specifically remember this room. The key to this one is that... Just want to line yourself up well... And do the... Okay, well, not not that. You see, the, the key is lining yourself up well, which is what I was not able to accomplish. So let's just wait till we get a little lower. Make sure my aim is fine. Okay. I love that room. It's just so neat. Alright, so onward to more level- ooh, King Lum. Yeah, I am not gonna be getting all of these Lums. Alright, yeah, I'll just cut my losses. Not really losses, but, you know, j just quit while I'm ahead. Oh, okay. Oh no! Well, I wasted my- okay, seriously. Well, I wasted everything there. Now watch me get hurt by the jellyfish here. Yeah, screw it. Quit while I'm ahead. Damn you! Oh my god. So so you, you can't even spin into that thing. I gotcha. Okay. Oh my. Okay. Looks like I could not do that little stretch of area without getting hurt. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Just gonna keep going. I'm not gonna worry about these enemies because they will more than likely kill me. Eh. Nope. Thorns hurt. Oh my god. Okay. Not too fond of this little area. Okay. That went considerably better. Now I just need to avoid the very tip. Hey, I'm at 300. Whatever. I don't care about disco time. I know that's a very messed up thing to say, but... I I've been playing for quite a bit. I've been playing for quite a bit. Just just can't worry about disco time. S serious. S ser seri seriously. Se that happened right there at the end. Ser ser seriously. Why, game? Why? Okay, I didn't get killed that time. Alright, fine, whatever, we're done here. Man. 
I should not have had that much trouble in that last room. But whatever. We did it. Somehow, some way, we did it. And I guess this part's gonna be long enough. I was gonna go ahead and squeeze in the chase part, but yeah, we'll, we'll just start off next time with that. So, with that, thank y'all for watching, and see you all next time for some more Rayman Origins, where we're gonna start things off with. Come on, I just wanna get the level name. Okay, yes, yes, we, we unlocked that. So we're going to be starting things off with Pirate's Treasure. Okay, see you then. Goodbye.